Okay, I wanted to do two things. Two things over here. Oh wait, I guess I'm gonna make it at three. All right, I did one of those three things. Okay, I originally just wanted to do one thing. I wanna run over there and see if there's any water. Let's do this. I guess I want to do four things now. Sexy tent. So where the bombs go? Oh. I get distracted too easily, damn it. Oh. Oh. Ah. And we even pushed the recording button. Alright, I am back. I had to piss. I made it to where I was going. Going uphill, folks. Man, there's no water here. That sucks. I was hoping to see water, damn it. I'm trying to find another case for this camera that isn't waterproof so I can use it hands free. But that waterproof case muffles the hell out of the sound and it's annoying. That's the thing I don't like about this sport camera, there's hardly any accessories for it. The only accessories I can find is more mounts. And I don't need mounts, I have enough of those. This brick is a brick. Ugh. Some advice to people that kick solid objects. Do not use your toe to kick it. Use your heel, like this. Otherwise you'll probably break your toe unless you're wearing steel-toed boots or something. But if you kick a solid object that weighs a lot, like this brick, and you're gonna kick it hard, use your heel, not your toe, like this. Now if I would have kicked it with my toe with that same force, I probably would have fractured my toe. Ugh. Learn how to kick stuff, damn it. Oh, screw this. There's another brick over here anyway. There was some old dude over there staring at me. A brick has been defeated. Pay attention to how I'm using my heel to kick stuff. 
is all you should use. Because your heel can take like at least 10 to 20 times more force than your toe. It's kind of like if you're going to throw a punch and you use your fist instead of your palm, your palm can take 10 times more force than your knuckles can. So if, so if you hit a solid object with your knuckles, you're probably going to break your knuckles. But if you use your palm, well, it's just going to feel really uncomfortable if you hit something really hard, but you're not going to break anything. It's just going to hurt a little. But if you use your knuckles and you punch, let's say like a wall or something, or you punch someone in the jaw, there's a chance you're probably going to break some of your knuckles. So use your palm. It's more powerful, it's usually more accurate, and you don't have to worry about breaking anything. Well, the only thing you can, you'll can you have to worry about breaking is whatever you're hitting, like another person, or other object. Damn! Look at all that trash. This is getting ridiculous. You see this shit? This stupid cement is falling apart. It's getting worse. It's just breaking more and more and more and it's just it's turning into this big trench and it's just filling up with garbage this is ridiculous I need to fix this already I need to find out where I can complain to the city that they're not fixing this shit it's like this whole section right here is breaking off you can see that crack right there this whole section is breaking off so if it starts flooding again this whole section might wash away and then it'll be even bigger right here and then it'll fill up with more trash all right i'm rambling enough and uh i'm probably gonna get the hell out of here before because a stupid old dude that was walking through here saw me breaking shit i mean i wasn't really breaking anything i just threw a brick on the floor and that brick was already broken so screw you who cares but people like to call the cops a lot around here for no reason like when I was at that bar over there, over there, I was at that bar after like 11 when it was closed and I was just standing at the fountain and like 10 fucking minutes later, a cop shows up. Like what the hell, I'm just standing here, leave me alone. I didn't realize that those security cameras were monitored in real time, so people were watching me stand there and they called the cops like a minute after I, I got there and I was just standing there. Anyway, like I said, that's the end of this video. Stay tuned for our stupid videos. See ya, folks!